Hello, my name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Dropbox in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com. And today I'm going to be talking about how to manage files and camera uploads in Dropbox. And camera uploads is the folder in your Dropbox account where pictures are automatically uploaded when you take a picture with your smartphone or your tablet or your iPod Touch or whatever. And what happens is uh, camera uploads over time gets a lot of pictures in them and a lot of uh, data. And the problem is, is you may run out of space in your Dropbox account, so you want to clear it out a bit. So my camera uploads folder, I've been using it since late 2011. It has thousands of pictures and movies in there, and I want to get rid of some of them. And here's how you do it. Now, one thing you can do is just delete them one by one, and that's pretty easy. So you, uh, select, you select the file, and then you just, right above it, it says delete, and you click it. And it says, you sure you want to do that? Yes, I'm positive. Now, um, that's good for one photo, but what if you want to delete more than one? Well, there's a couple techniques you can use. One is you can select it, and then you can hold down the shift key and the down arrow key on your PC or Mac and just select the ones that you want to get rid of. And then you would do the same thing. Um, you, As you select them, you would find the delete button above it and just hit delete, and they're gone. Okay. Now, there's something else you can do if you want to be really drastic about it, and that is to select one of the photos you want to get rid of, and then hit either uh, Control A on a PC or Command A on a Mac. It selects all of them, and you could actually delete all 674 of them at once. I don't recommend doing this, and the reason is photos are special. You may have something irreplaceable on that. And it's probably better to go through and, ch and find the ones you want to keep and take those out before you do something like uh, selecting all the photos inside camera uploads and deleting them. So that's one way to free up some space in your Dropbox account. One thing I should add, even though you've just deleted those photos in the movies that are in camera uploads, they still exist in case you change your mind. And here's how you see them. Go to your camera uploads folder and go to the icon right above it that says show deleted files. Click on that. And it's going to show the files that were uh, deleted. It's going to take a little bit of time to do that. Still thinking about it. Yep, there they are. So these are the photos that I deleted before. It says deleted image and deleted video. Um, it gives you an option of either restoring it by pressing the restore button or permanent, permanently deleting it by pressing the permanently delete button. Click that. That particular photo will be permanently deleted. Of course, if you want to, you can do the batch delete again. Select one and then hold down the shift key and the arrow key and select more or do the uh, control A or the command A thing to get all of them at once. So that's how you manage a space in your camera uploads folder. For more advice about how to use Dropbox, some great tips and tricks as well as the basics for getting set up on either a PC or a Mac or a mobile device, Dropbox in 30 minutes is the only guide you'll need at in30minutes.com. Thank you.